And one more shaft and mouse away. Wet with la 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 la. Hey guys, welcome to today's video, which is my beauty faves. And this isn't like a monthly beauty faves or anything like that, or like yearly or something, I don't know. It's just things I've been loving recently because. If you watched my winter skincare video that I just did, I talked about how I basically had to overhaul like a lot of beauty products that I use. So yeah, we're going to talk about that and we're going to talk about all the stuff I am using and how I've changed. Um, so actually I'm going to start with perfume. My two current favourite perfumes are Daisy Marc Jacobs Twinkle, which looks like this. And this one, if you like, um, if you smell any of the Daisy ones, this is just like a little bit deeper, sexier, like more like mystical. I love it. I really, I mean, you can tell I love it because it's nearly out. <laughs> and then I got this one for Christmas because I asked for it <laughs> from my boyfriend, fiance. Um, and it's the newest one, which is Daisy Love. Um, oh, so sweet. Because there's a Daisy Love that's like the white and gold creamy kind of colorway and then this pink one and this is just super fresh I feel like it's not as like fruity smelling as the original oh so sweet that I do love that's like my all-time fave um and it's a little bit more grown up I feel than that one and I love the bottle um it's actually like look it's got like petals oh it's so cute love that I've been loving eye drops uh, the refreshing eye drops for tired eyes from Optrex. Um, yeah, just if I've got tired eyes, dry eyes. Often after I've taken my makeup off, I find that my eyes get really dry. Use these. They're great. Also, if you're flying, traveling, I mean, no, no one should be traveling right now uh, with what's going on in the world. But um, yeah, if you've been on a flight or anything, I've been using these and yeah, love them. They're great. So I've never been into eye creams and then I got this um literally to use after i was taking my makeup off because i was having loads of problems with swollen eyes which my whole winter skincare video goes into so i won't bore you with that but um it's called the puffy eye attack uh turbo boost hydrogel helps fight dark circles and under eye puff and it's um by soap and glory and it's a little pot like this and you barely need to use any and I just put it on in the morning and the evening and I'm not religious with it, I don't do it every single night but I, you do do it after I've uh, worn makeup and then taken it off and I do find that it helps so yes, 10 out of 10 would recommend there it is also from Soap and Glory is the Peaches and Clean Deep Cleansing Milk 4-in-1 Wash Off Melts Away 4-in-1 la, 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 la. Wash Off melts away makeup for all skin types um this is how i take my makeup off now it's the only thing i use to take my makeup off um i actually wet my face and then i just put some of this on my hands and then i rub it in really really gently and then i use a wet flannel to wipe it off and then i'll do it again like it normally needs to uh but yeah very very good i love it it's the only thing i'll use to take my makeup off now and also from soap and glory junk the gunk um, this is a deep cleansing shampoo which gets rid of product build up and exfoliates your scalp. I've been having a million scalp problems <laughs> that I'm absolutely sick of um, and this has helped loads. Um, you don't use it, I don't know how much it recommends to use it, one or two times a week in replacement of your normal shampoo. Um, really, really great. My scalp feels lovely afterwards. And then this, Soap and Glory, the scrub of your life. Now, this drew me in because it says on the front of it, um, how you'll know it's the one. Rough, rough elbows go suddenly silky, dry shins come shimmery, the bumps from the backs of your arms are gone. That's what it was. I've never in my life suffered with this, but recently I've had like, those weird little bumps on the backs of my arms and they've been driving me insane. This gets rid of it. It's the only thing I've found that gets rid of it. So yeah, it's really gentle. It doesn't I've got really sensitive skin. It doesn't affect my skin, and I love it. It's called the scrub of your life. I have used Simple Moisturizer on my face exclusively since I was literally 14, 13, 15, somewhere around there. Um, but recently I have converted to the rich version. There's a light version, which is what I've always used because I needed 
the lightest, thinnest, most simple um, moisturiser on my face. And so that's what I've always used because I've got really sensitive skin and also my lupus affects my skin, especially on my face. Um, this says for sensitive skin, simple, replenishing, rich moisturiser. 12 hour moisturisation, rich, kind to skin. Um, yeah, and I used this because in the winter my skin was really suffering, hence the winter skincare video. And yeah, I, I'm a convert and I love it. I probably will go back to the other one um when the warmer weather comes but for the time being that is the only moisturizer i use on my face basically i use a soap and glory one occasionally but mainly it's that so ever since i went on holiday i've been doing my makeup a little differently where i just got this like little what i always call a baby tan <laughs> when i was in tenerife in january um where it just i don't ever get tanned but my skin was like a little bit glowy and everyone kept telling me how healthy i looked and it was nice um and then obviously it fades away and i'm back to my casper the friendly ghost complexion so what i've been doing is a combo of what i just used on holiday so i do my makeup like normal but i use the hula benefit bronzer and i just get a big fluffy brush I lightly get it and i just go ch -ch -ch, a little bit on my nose a little bit on my forehead done then on top of that I use the Benefit Cal California blush that is a lovely peachy blush and normally I'm really into my pinks um, but I just find that feels summery and more warm and yeah I put that over the top and I do actually just go do, do, do in the exact same places and then the Benefit Cookie highlighter um, it's stunning I got it for Christmas um, Ooh, girl yeah it's great and um I, I just love that i'm actually wearing it today with a Too faced highlighter over the top Ooh, i'm shining 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 yeah and on the body i've been loving Too faced um i don't know this doesn't actually have, like have a name on it what is it called kissable body shimmer it comes with your little poof poof comes with your little poof like so and um yeah you just dab it and put it on your body and it's a lovely shimmer again i started using that on holiday and then i've used it ever since and i adore it and it's so cute and last but not least i've been very into glitter um yeah i've actually got two different types of what i'm about to show you on my eyes today i am obsessed it's the urban decay heavy metal uh glitter eyeliners and i've got colors sticks and bones which is this one it's like a really uh dark brownie with silver specks kind of like petrol it reminds me of um glitter and then i've got grind which is this gorgeous pearlescent and i've got that on my highlight and then i actually have put it all around here as well today um and then the last one i've got is cat call and that's what i'm wearing up here in my eyeliner um that's not it <laughs> where is it there it is and it's this gorgeous like coppery i don't know how much the camera is going to pick that up but it is like coppery it's got pinks and oranges and reds in there stunning i want every color they do lots of more colors and i want them all that's it just a really short video but these are just like new a lot of the new stuff i've been using and loving and um just wanted to share that with you because i've been more into beauty products i want to give a special shout out to primark nail polishes they are now my go-to i have because of again because of my lupus my nails like peel literally like an onion and Primark's one of the only ones where I can put it on and it will stay on for a week and it's not a great example today because this is a Primark colour which is stunning but can you see this finger's bare um, they're all chipped that's my bad uh, I did them and didn't leave them to actually get hard and, and cold and set and I started doing housework and chipped them all immediately normally they're not like that normally they're the only ones i find that don't chip on my nails so yeah and they do such good colors and also they do really little bottles which i like because that means the brush is tiny which i also like and then my other special shout out is to simples de-stress face masks 
I'm obsessed with them. They're like my go-to face mask and I've been super stressed recently. <laughs> so I've been using them a lot and I love them. They're like, they bring my skin back to life. So if you're looking for a sheet mask, that's the one I recommend. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big like to show me that you did and let me know what your beauty favourites are. I love hearing from other people. Or any, if you've got anything for sensitive skin or anything that you would recommend for scalp problems, please put it in the comments because I'm desperate. I'm kind of like found some stuff that's helping, but it's doing my nothing. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I hope you're having a lovely day and I will see you in the next video. Bye.